is a cow or one of those shawls that you put around your shoulders that hold your arms in. So this is very, very cozy, very comfortable. It's, it's a cow. So I used circular needles. I used number 10 circular needles and I used two baby yarns knitted together, which is a number three. So number 10 circular needles, of course your stitches need to be able to go around your your circular needle so they cannot be long. And the number of stitches is you knit 10 and purl 10. Knit 10, purl 10. So that means that you need to have a multiple of 20 to go uh, to, uh, you know, the number of stitches that you need to cast on. Here I have 140. So what you do is that you knit and purl around and you do it for 12 rows. And the way you count them is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And then, because I, I count the curlies, it's much easier. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So you count your, your rows, you go 10 stitches and 12 rows, and then you change. So you change exactly on top of where you cast it on. So of course you're going to go around 12 times and then when you get here you purl your 10 and then you purl 10 again and then knit 10, purl 10, knit 10. So that's the way to do it. And you go all the way to the top and then on the top when, you, when you're done with your work, let's make a look. And so on the top, when you're done, you're going to pick up your stitch, like so, and we are going to sew it in there to form a new stitch. So like that, it's not, it doesn't show. You go to the back, let's pass this only one, and then you divide your yarn in only one needle. Find a little space in there. Make a little knot. And then it's not going to go anywhere because you already have the knot real nice and tight in there. Pick up your two strands and now we can weave these in and hide that knot. So let's weave them in. And you do that with the other side also. So that we have them. Hide it in there. And see so you can't you can't see your strand. It's gone, it's hidden. You cut your yarn and then you do the, the beginning. But the beginning is the same thing. What you do is that you go and pick up where that knot is. Let's straighten this thing and then you go back to the beginning. Make sure there's all these are straight. That are they're not wobbly in there. So there we go. Okay. So now this is going to go to the back. 
there and then we do the same thing we make a little knot with only one Yay! Yay! that's my grandson Yay! my beautiful Nicholas <laughs> he's crawling all over the place and talkative so cute he's one year old 13 months. He's 13 months old. So now I'm going to weave this in. And, and we cut that strand there. And there we have it. And now we have a very nice cow. And or shawl, I don't know why how you want to call it because it goes around and it looks nice and wavy at the beginning and nice and wavy at the end, and that's what it is. And uh, thank you for watching, and please like yeah. us and share us with yeah. your friends, and I'll keep seeing you. Mm -hmm.